Hey, what's going on guys? This is my short update video. The video that explains why you haven't seen videos. I know, it's kind of like a weird parallel, isn't it? Well, there's Gus. We all know Gus, right? He's being a good boy. Well, he has some visitors. He's doing some, uh, he's having a hangout, a guy hangout. So, we have Oliver, which you guys know, a little Boston Terrier. And here comes the newest acquisition by my friend, that is Remy. Remy is short for Remington. He is my friend's brand new yellow lab puppy. And he is pretty cool for, for a puppy. And he's Oliver's best friend. And right now they're just kind of hanging and chilling with Gus. So, I've been watching them. And I can't make videos in the background because they're going to be squeaking the ball. They have really loud squeaky toys. And they're going to be making noise and playing and jumping up and down and stuff. So I can't do like reviews or you know, any kind of other videos right now. But I only have them for a few days, so we'll be back in business pretty soon. Maybe I'll squeak out a video if they all take a nap together or something. But i um, been doing that lately, and uh, that's pretty much it. Yesterday I went to Pocono Raceway, which is very cool. It's the first time they had an indie race there. I got tickets at Christmas time as a surprise gift. So that was really, it was interesting. I've never followed any kind of indie racing. And um, it was it was cool. Uh, you know, I don't I don't know many of the drivers. I mean, I know some of the obvious drivers. Uh, hey, drop my cell phone. <laughs> That's always great. But hopefully it's still working. Um, anyway, just a quick little update. That's why I've been inactive, because I'm just doing stuff here. Uh, I will show you just a very short clip or a couple pictures from the, uh, the race. But um, I don't know what I said, because I don't know at what point I dropped the phone. <laughs> but uh, I went to an indie race at Pocono Raceway. It was the first time they had an indie race there. And it was interesting. It was cool. It was an experience. Um... They're, they're racing faster. I mean, they're open wheel vehicles, so it was just different. De definitely a different experience, but anyway, I gotta go chase the puppies down before I lose them. Oh, there they are. They're being good. Okay. By the way, I do still have my Monte Carlo. I know people ask me in messages a couple times. I still have it. This is now my project car. Um, there's very little things I want to do to it. Mechanically, I just need to fix a gasket for the uh, oil pan. Not a, ex well, it's an expensive task because you have to pull the engine out a little bit, but it's, it's not too bad. Mechanically, it's fine. Uh, I'll probably get it painted eventually. Maybe some new, new tires and wheels and possibly a uh, exhaust system for it. But besides that, not, not really doing anything for it. And then the car, I still love. Well, that's a super close-up. Can't really see anything there. The car I still love. You know, people have mixed feelings about Chryslers. I've never owned a Chrysler. This is my first one. I could not be happier, honestly. I'll talk more about it in the future, but I really, really enjoy the car. Uh, you know, it drives great. It's, it's good on gas, you know. I'm happy with it. It's all American. Straight out of Detroit. I'll show you the inside, but it's all locked up. But anyway, um, that's pretty much it. Just a quick little update. So I gotta tend to the puppies. It's time to eat. You guys wanna eat? You go inside? Gus, you hungry? You want some lunch? Yeah? Gus knows lunch. <laughs> Alright, it's the fuzz. I gotta go. <laughs> See you later.